What's up guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. My name is Technomide and in today's video we're just looking at how to get epic cinematic look using Sony Vegas. So we're in Sony Vegas right now and this trick should work out with Sony Vegas 14, 13, 12 and 11 and also some of the previous version, I hope so. So first off we're in Sony Vegas and we have some video over here and what I want you guys to do is drag and drop this video over to our timeline. Okay so first off what we have to do is go to project settings and over here we need to choose HDV 720, 30p or 25p. It depends on your frame per second but you know you can choose any one of them. It does not really matter. Okay. The next step is going over to brightness and contrast, choosing the default one and dragging and dropping it to your video. Over here what we're gonna do is choose out the contrast to be like 0.1. Okay, now what we do it gives us a little bit darker effect. If you click here, we might be able to see the original video on the left and the edited video on the right. So we can see that the video looks much better with the nice dark contrast. Now on the video effects we have to go to color corrector and you might choose one of the options given here you might add red mid tone. Uh, red mid tone is popularly used in the cinematic film look or you might choose to add a blue mid tone. Blue mid tone is also used a lot if you want to create out a nice soothing kind of effect if you want to have like a dark effect like someone is talking smoothing and like something like that I hope you get it what I'm trying to say but you know instead of both of these you may try these you uh, we're gonna go with the cinematic one that is actually given by the Sony Vegas itself or probably this is one of my presets okay so I've completely forgotten about this that is this actually preset given by the Sony Vegas itself or is it a preset by me if it's not a preset already you may copy out the settings from here uh, they, uh, it should look something like this and in my opinion it looks out the best okay so the third step the, or sorry fourth step that we're gonna be doing is going over to event pan and crop and over here we're gonna drag this down a little bit so this kind of effect creates out these black bars and you might have seen these black bars in films very often. So yeah, if you can check out the original video on the left and the edited video on the right, you may see a big difference in both of them. Um, the right one does look a bit better with a nice contrast and a red mid tone applied to it. It gives us a much better quality compared to the left one. and. If we just see, uh, the edited one looks much much better than the original one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's try to get 15 likes on this video. And as always, my name is Technomite. Peace and out.